Yo, what are YouTube Zero here, and welcome to Bravely Default the demo. Downloaded it earlier today. I played it for like a minute, turned it off, and said, you know what? Let me record it. I've been waiting for this game for some time, and honestly, I've been waiting for a game to play like Final Fantasy IV on the DS since I completed it years ago when it first came out on the original DS. And I was hoping Square Enix would release like Final Fantasy V or Final Fantasy VI on the DS or the 3DS the same way they remade Final Fantasy IV on the DS and it did not happen. In fact, I think we're probably going to end up seeing Final Fantasy V, VI, and VII on mobile devices before we even see them released on Vita or 3DS, which is a disappointment, but Bravely Default seems to fill the void of Final Fantasy V and VI, so let's hope it's as good. Let's test this out. Oh man, I really hope this game is good. I mean, it's been getting positive reviews in um, Famitsu Magazine. I think even the, what is it, it's Bravely Default and then Bravely Default for the sequel, I think, which alters the battle system or something like that, it adds content. Those been getting positive reviews. Okay, so three save slots, that's cool. Let's begin. Standards difficulty recommended for all, but the most hardcore players. You can change the settings in game from the config screen as well. Okay, so you can change the difficulty on the fly. Unlike Batman Arkham Origins, which I started playing on hard, and it's fucking pissing me off. But that's a topic for another video. We're gonna start on hard. It says enemies are stronger. For those who need an extra challenge, you can change the settings. Yeah, if I get raped, I'll just go into the options and change it. Now, I don't know if... Oh, I'll discuss that later. Let's just begin. Auto save, yes. It says, uh, blah, 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 yes. Let's do this. I love the graphics. Alright, so... Who is talking? Alright, let me, uh... Let me tell you something that I hate about RPGs today. And it doesn't seem like this is doing it, and that's awesome. I hate how, ever since I played this Gaia on the PS2, Hour of Darkness, how they have the pictures of the characters who are talking on screen, but they don't show their in-game character model. And I get it, it's like a 2D game. But I hate when they do that. And every, every RPG does that today. With the exclusion of like Super Nintendo and PlayStation 1 and Sega Saturn RPGs. Now it's like every every mobile game does it. Like uh, Shin Megami Tensei 4 does it. Fire Emblem does it. Pokemon doesn't do it. But a lot of games tend to do that. And it's rather annoying. But this game, it seems to keep it pretty basic. And that's awesome. Even though I don't know who's talking. I think Agnes is the girl with the moving skirt. I don't know. It is I, the Wind Vestal. Agnes Oblige. What is the matter, Prime Minister? Ah, Lady Vestal. Oh, you saw that? Caught it. Welcome back to our fair city. Uh, who's Tiz? I'm guessing it's one of the guys up there. Sorry to call you away from your duties like this. No, not at all. I was in the area already. Tell me what this is all about. Well, there's something I need you and your friends to help us with, Lady Vestal. Things must be bad if you're calling on us for help. Quite bad, I'm afraid. You're all aware of Norindi Village, I trust. Tch, yeah, I grew up there. You don't say, a native of Norindi Village? Fate does work in mysterious ways. Well, this should require a little explanation then. As you know, rebuilding of the village has just begun. Answering the call of the King of Kaldizla, we plan to contribute to restoration efforts ourselves. Okay, man. Was there some kind of problem? Yes. Ever since the Great Chasm opened, the creatures skulking around these parts have grown restless. Well then, good luck to you all. The town's people will tell you more when you see them. Our soldiers are kept busy dealing with this unruly beast. 
and guarding the city. <coughs> Sorry, guys. I realize that you all have your own business to attend to. But might you be able to lend us some support, Lady Vestal? Understood. Of course we will. What? Magnus, don't you think? Don't you want to think about it first? It's your home, Tiz. That concerns us. That concerns all of us now, right? Exactly. I'm sure King of Bell agrees. Who the fuck are these people, man? These are some weird names. Ah, oh, that's King of Bell? Okay, I guess. No, wait, that's Tiz. You're all too kind. No, wait, no, that is... Wait a minute, I don't get it. Who's Tiz? Tiz, I think, is the one on the right, and King of Bell is on... Ring a Bell. Oh, Ring a Bell? Oh, snap. Ring a Bell's on the left. Time for you to put your little title of Chairman of the Restoration Effort to work, Tiz. Yeah. Oh. You're in charge of Narindi's Restoration Effort. Then you will be able to... Issue instructions to the village people gathered for the restoration. Even while traveling in distant lands. Our people are helping gather resources in the little spare time they have. But progress is slow. Once the restoration makes progress... You know, this is what's weird. It's like, the Prime Minister is talking, but this dickhead, Tiz, is moving around. As if he's the one speaking. That's, that's what's confusing me. I keep looking at the in-game character models, which is weird. I need to stop doing that. Once restoration makes progress, you're sure to re-up the rewards of your noble actions. I'll do my best to live up to the honor the king bestows upon me. Alright, are we gonna play? Ooh, we are playing. I'm assuming this is not the beginning of the game. So I don't I could have sworn they said in the article when this demo was announced that you can transfer your save like you can in Etron Odyssey. Which is uh, not the case, it seems. Right, hit right on the control pad, or touch, or blah, 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 blah. Okay, let's do this. Every street pass, I don't care about street pass, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So we're moving around, and it seems like he runs pretty slowly. I mean, that's... Actually, wait a minute. What the hell was that? So he moved mad fast down the stairs. He moves super quick down the stairs, but when he's... That's so funny. <laughs> Alright, I want to see something. Hang on. There's a... Oh. Let's go talk with the people in town. Oh, they got a hint system? Oh, that's so freaking awesome. You know what's funny? I remember when Final Fantasy used to come out, like, because I started really playing Final Fantasy 7, right? Then I played 8, played 9, played 10, played 12, hated 13. So, I wasn't really with the... I didn't start off playing Final Fantasy since 1. But I did play the other games, like I beat 2... Uh, which is really four. Um, I beat four, I beat six, I beat seven, eight, nine, ten, and twelve. But I didn't beat one or two, I didn't beat three, and I didn't play five very much. But one thing I recall is every time since seven, every time I entered the menu system, I wanted to see how the menu system was enhanced. I know it's pretty simple, but I loved it. Like Final Fantasy X, had an amazing menu system. Like I really loved, like how shiny it was, and it had like, like, like the 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 different tabs had like reflections on them, and it was so beautiful. I think that Final Fantasy X had like the best menu system. Period. I don't remember twelve, but I think twelve was up there too. But I just don't remember it right now. But I really loved it. And I I loved naming my characters. I don't know if the game uh, Bravely Default lets you name them. It'll be unfortunate. Cause I really love naming my Final Fantasy characters, but I don't think you can with this, unless because it's the demo it don't let you. All right, so let me see something. Ability. All right, so job command unuse. Shivery black magic. Huh. Hmm. You know what? Let me give them. A, I think all of this stuff right here. It it kind of sucks because I'm assuming this is the. This is the job class system, and it seems like everything's just unlocked from, from the jump. I'm guessing the, the final game won't be like that. That kind of sucks that the demo's ruining it. We'll see. Alright, let's see something. Uh, fix command. Late bloomer. Your stats increase based on the number of jobs for which you have mastered all abilities. Okay. You know 
what? I'll give her shivery. She looks like a shivery person. We'll give this guy... He looks like someone that jumps. So where the hell is it? Where's the Lancer? Lancer, 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 Lancer. Where are you? Up oh, right there. Acrobatics. And obviously I'm going to give her... I'm going to do white magic for now. Even though I think she suits a black mage. Her character, that is. And the tactics. Alright, so... Um... Yeah, so this is basically it. I mean, it doesn't seem to have anything... Nothing serious. Okay, so yeah. Yeah, that's about it. Alright, let's get to the game. Alright, for this demo version, the times people give you quests to solve. The full version is different. Speak with the people marked in blue on the map to take on quests. Okay. You can transfer the following data from the demo version over to the full friends, not including. So weird. Eh, that's about it, I guess. Depending on how much the demo version you complete, you can earn a variety of items from when you start the full version. There are seven play bonuses altogether. If you get them all, you'll gain a big head start in the early part of the full game. The stories in this demo version are not found in the full game, so you can't transfer your experience, job, or items over to it. Enjoy these additional scenes. Then you can develop the characters how you want through the main story in the full game. Yep, just as suspected. Okay. All right, let's do this. I really let me see how the 3D looks in this game. Whoa, man, the 3D is ridiculous. Holy crap, man! I'm gonna tell you this right now, guys. If you're not experiencing this game in 3D, you are missing out. Holy shit, it looks amazing. What really helps is just the way the the town. It's rendered like like it has like that 3D feel even when you're not you don't have the 3D activated you know. Oh, it's a de Anheim is a desert city. Almost everything in town is run by the Grand Mill over there. That big cloak there runs on wind power too. It's a symbol of the town. Cool. Let's talk to this chick right here. If you head west of the city, you'll find a cave we use to spot uh, stockpile things. The monsters there shouldn't give you much trouble, but why not go and brush up on your skills there for a while? Yeah, I'm really interested in seeing the battle system. The temple to the south and the forest to the northeast are home to the powerful foes to take care. Of. Right, let's do this. I can't really like it's pointless to do like the whole like getting the seven bonuses because I'm playing on my regular 3DS and I mainly play the game on my XL. So, and you take on classic combats. Default to store up power, then brave to unleash it on your foe. So that's why it's called bravely default. I've been wondering why they called it that. Like, I, I've even come up with some dumb uh, <laughs> uh, analysis. Like, brave, bravely default meaning being brave for staying the same as the old Final Fantasy games. <laughs> okay, uh, by declining to act during a turn, you can store up bravely default which allows you to carry over that action into a later turn. Default also lessens damage taken that turn. Use the turns you've banked or take future turns in advance to perform multiple actions during a single turn. Use it when the time is right to drop the hammer on tough foes. Taking an advance on future turns will drive your BF negative. You'll recover one per turn but can't act until you reach zero. Okay, it's a high risk, high reward proposition. Use it wisely. Okay, I don't know how to say it. Listen to this. Yeah, so he moves pretty fucking slow. I thought Nino Kuni's main character moved slow in the world map, but this guy, I think he's going for the crown. Man, I haven't played a game with a world map like this in a long time. Look at the 3D. Whoa, this looks crazy, man. I'm not a 3D guy. Like, I don't play my games in 3D very much. Oh, here we go. Oh, these graphics are fucking crazy.
Nah, okay, guys, sorry about that. I was listening to the song. Another thing that I loved about Final Fantasy games was hearing how different their battle theme was. And lately, I'm not gonna lie, I feel like battle themes haven't been as great as they used to in Ascent Corrected. Although this is a good battle theme, and it's pretty hype, it's not as cool as Final Fantasy IX's, or Final Fantasy VIII's, or... You know, you get, you get what I mean. Like, so I, I feel like certain battle themes are just... I'll never get bored of. So let's begin. Alright, so I think... Let me see here. Usable Shido ability. Nothing ventured. Let me see how this works. I think he changes his skin in battle. Let me see. Alright, so it's turn-based. Alright. Chivalry. Ironclad. I just want to see how this looks. Let me see something. And let's see. Spend BF to increase your actions. Go on the defensive and increase your BF. Alright, let's test this out. Okay, so nothing ventured. Alright. Okay, so I I could have sworn that the character classes changed their appearance, but I think the abilities like when you see like Boshido and stuff like that, I think that's just um, I think that's like a secondary job class. I, I I'm assuming it is. I could have sworn it was, but let's see. This guy's going downtown. Ally list, okay. All right, this guy doesn't really. Let me see something. All right, let's test this out. So I I did a default, so now I'm gonna use my break points. Let's see how this works. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing. All right. So I don't think magicians really have any advantage when they have that, but we'll see. Oh, she can go multiple times. Oh, that's crazy. Oh. Oh, go again. Oh, shit! You dodged it. Oh, you ain't gonna dodge that one though. <laughs> he did the jump. Oh man, this is fucking awesome. All right, so what's this? Examine displays. Okay, let me see how this works. Let's see how much information it displays. Oh shit, you fucking died. Awesome. All right, so I think it 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 plays a lot like Final Fantasy. Um, well, classic Final Fantasy, because 13 plays nothing like classic Final Fantasy, and 12 didn't either. And 10, I think 10 was as close as it got, but it was still a little, I don't know, it didn't really feel like Final Fantasy with the exclusion of maybe the summons. Alright, so we're fighting some anacondas here, and we're fighting some cat motherfucker, and they got the advantage. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Holy fuck. I shouldn't have ventured here. All right, so that's not good. All right, it says lower damage taken. Hell to the nose. I'm not doing that shit. All right, so they killed Ring a Bell. All right, raises. No, no, no. All right, let me see something. Can she? Does she have? Nope. And this is what I don't understand. But what's their default class? Like, like, how does that even work? Like, why can't it? It's so weird. Alright, let's try to... These guys are gonna kill me. I'm gonna die. Oh, shit. Alright. This cat has a lot of life. Hope he dies before I die. Let's mash that A button. Damn, man. Ah, oh, shit, man. Fuck, we're gonna have to run away. We are definitely running away. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck! Shit, man. Party was wiped out. Autosave, can you, say, can you help me here? Ah, oh, okay. What is this, AR movie? 
No, let's try that again. I might have to just put it back on normal because, yeah, that's not good. So, yeah, not good. Oh, I'm an idiot. It's right there, job. Okay. See, look at that. The demo gives you, like, all the fucking job classes. It's so stupid. All right, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to give him the night. Oh, snap, you saw him. Destination. Um, to equip, I guess? To ability? What's that all about? Yeah, no, I don't know what this is about. So let's change this chick's job class down here. Actually, let me see something. What I'll do, I'll give her black mage. <laughs> it's so freaking awesome. Ability. We'll give the job command white magic. I'm guessing job command is like secondary abilities, I'm guessing. Increase the power of black magic based on, okay. All right, let me see something. We'll give this guy, we'll give him the Valkyrie, which is the Lancer from Final Fantasy. And uh, destination, uh, let's see something. Yeah, no, I don't really have much items to even equip. I wonder if you can cut, I don't think you can customize them. That would have been even more awesome if you can. We'll give this chick, let me see. I'll give her, I'm about to give her the Red Mage. I remember Final Fantasy, Tactics, Advanced. I love the Red Mage. I thought she was freaking awesome. We'll give her the ninja. We'll give her the ninja ability because with the classic Final Fantasy games, you can attack twice with the ninja. And I'm hoping it's the same thing. So hopefully that's how it works. And we are definitely going to save because I don't want to die and then have to do this all over again. And I was an idiot. Let me see something. Save, buddy. Yes, let's save. What's the add friends thing? Oh, and in the world, and in the world map is different. You know, I, I'm surprised that you can't change the camera when you're when you're walking around. So let me see something. How, how far can I venture off without having to worry about fighting enemies that are gonna rape me? Oh, look who it is. All right, so we'll try this. Shivery, Ironclad, Bushido, nothing ventured. I'm gonna try the default with him because he's a knight, so I'm guessing he's a powerhouse. Ninjutsu, evade one physical attack, la 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 la. Let's see if she attacks twice. I don't think she does, but she probably does, who knows. Acrobatics, jump. I'm gonna jump this asshole, abilities. And she doesn't even have anything as a black mage right now. So it's a waste. I'm gonna change her job. I don't think you can do it on the, f I don't think you can do it on the fly, but. I'll just do it in the next battle. Alright, let's check. Damn, that's a lot of damage. Nah, she didn't attack twice, but she attacked pretty hard, though. Alright, so we'll do... Brave, Brave, Brave. Damn. I think the Brave meter is shared throughout the whole party, I think. Oh, wait a minute. That's what they're talking about, like... Hang on, guys. You remember how they said that you get negative points and then you can't attack until it reaches zero? That's what that is. You see this? I'm going to attack pretty hard, but I'm going to lose my ability to attack. So I'm just going to do it once. Attack this asshole. Attack him again. That's pretty cool, though. Alright. And then again, like, she's... Eh, it's kind of weird. I guess I'll understand the game as I play it more, you know? Alright, footwork, huh? Oh, that's how you go down, buddy! Oh, yeah! Oh, you're gonna get hit again, buddy! Oh. So this is what I don't get. It says negative one. Why does it say negative one? I can still attack. Which is weird, I don't know, I don't get it. Like, I guess every time you you use, uh, you know, when you do something, whether it's attack, or maybe it's only when you do attacks. Yeah, it seems like it's it's anything, any action you take, takes away a brave point. I don't know, that's weird. 
I'm gonna switch her from a black mage because it doesn't seem like she's doing anything with it. Oh, you're gonna jump? That's how it's done? Yeah, so you get... It doesn't seem like you get... Yeah, you do get job class experience points. Let's see. Yep, you do. So you get the job points, like in Final Fantasy Tactics and Final Fantasy V, which is cool. That Black Mage, I don't know, man. Black Mage is about to get taken out. I mean, it would be awesome to have a Black Mage in my party, so I'm guessing when I level up the Black Mage, I'm going to get, like, Fire or Fira or something like that. So you know what? I'll keep the Black Mage for now, but I'm thinking of probably putting it in... E on normal, because these guys are doing heavy damage. Let me see something. How do I do that? I think it's here, hang on. What's this? What's this all about? I don't want street pass, man. Come on. What's this? What's this? Nah, I don't want this restoration. Come on. How the hell did they said you could do it in the menu? How did, where's the menu, man? Config difficulty. There we go, and it is getting put right back on normal. Wait a minute, you can change the encounter rates. That is insane! Oh my god, I can't believe they did that. Oh man, let's test this out. Hang on, this is freaking crazy. Job points gain. What? You can turn that off. Oh, oh my god. Whoa, man. Acquire, whether well, gain money. How is that even possible? I can't believe they added filters to making the game harder. That is insane. Holy crap, that's fucking amazing. Wow, man. Let's test this out. Let's see how fast I can fight. Okay, that was pretty quick. Whoa, man, that's crazy. And looky, looky, look who it is. Time to get revenge on you, asshole. But, I'm going on the defensive for now. So is she, and this man is going to jump on your tail. Alright, so, yeah, I'll just attack her for now. Let's do this. Ah, oh, not good. All right, use protect on him. All right, brave. All right, so let me see something. Brave, brave, brave. All right, I just want to see something. Now this cat's gonna get raped. so funny. It's not over yet. Oh. oh, man. I wanted to see if, like, what would happen when it was Agnes's turn. Alright, so you leveled up. Leveled up, leveled up, leveled up. You know what I hate? I hate when I'm playing an RPG. Like, let's say if I'm playing... Uh, let me see. The, the perfect example is this game, right? Let's say I'm playing a game, and you see how they're all equal leveled? Like, so they're all gaining the same amount of experience. I hate when I'm playing an RPG and someone dies during a boss battle or someone dies in a tough battle and they all gain different experience points going forward because one person died, so now he's gonna get different, he's gonna level up on a different time than someone else, whether it's the next battle or battle, like two battles after that. I hate that in RPGs. Like, I try my best to not let people die around, like, oh, look at that. I try not to let people die in battle, but obviously it's gonna happen, even in boss battles, you know? All right, so we're fighting these guys. Who are these guys? They're imps? Okay. So let's test that out again. Let's do, I'm gonna do Brave. And she's just gonna attack. And he's gonna jump. But we're gonna hit the one in the middle. And she doesn't have any black mage attacks yet, so that kinda sucks. Ah, oh, 
Wait a minute. Ah, oh, I didn't. I just. I didn't. I wasn't paying attention to their HP. Oh man. So I don't think I have any items, but hang on. Brave, 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 brave. All right, I'm gonna test this out. I'm gonna see after I use all three braves if I can even attack on, on my next turn. So I'm gonna use some items and see if I got a phoenix down or something. Nope, I do not. That kind of sucks, but I will heal myself. You evade one physical attack, I'll come. Shit, man, these guys are doing heavy damage. Oh, thank god. Alright. Alright, so at least I'm protected for one turn. Oh! Oh, man. That healed a lot. Let's give it to Tiz. Let me see some of the helm. Yeah, see, look. It, it, it doesn't seem like Tiz is going at all. So he skipped the turn. That's kind of crazy. Alright, so... You know what? I don't want to waste any more of my potions, but... Fuck, man! Damn, man, that's not good. Summon a friend, summon or send to a friend. What is that? I'm not gonna do that. What the hell is that? Alright. Missed again, buddy. Yeah, these guys have a massive amount of health. Alright, Tiz is back. Alright, one is down. There's two left, though, so I'm gonna just see if... Um, what I'll do is I'm gonna just go on a defensive... Use a potion on myself. Hopefully, I don't get killed. Alright, good. Alright, I won this one. I remember there was a time when I was playing Final Fantasy XII, and I was playing for about maybe two hours, and I fucking died. And it pissed me off. Oh my god, it pissed me off. I was like, towards the end of the game, I was just leveling up. And you don't understand how pissed I was when I, I lost that. I lost my save. It was just like, oh, I didn't really save, lose my save, but I lost progress and it was really irritating. Alright, so. Let's do this. He's gonna die. I mean, even if he were to successfully cast silence on me, I don't have any abilities that use magic, so. Fuck, what a waste. Fuck, what a waste. Fuck, what a waste! What? Let's run away. Yeah, smart move that I played there running away because these guys are gonna kill me. Please successfully run. Woo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> oh man. I don't get it, like why can't I hold L and R like I like you used to in the old Final Fantasy games to run away? I remember how stupid they used to look running away in boss battles, and they just would run, run, run in place, run in place, run in place, and, you know... You know what's kind of cool? You can use the random encounter rate to your advantage. Let me see something. What was it that I said? The encounter rate has been lowered to not... This will make the game harder to gain levels. That's fine. It's totally fine, but you know it will make it easier for me to get back to town and heal. And can I enter from behind? Nope, I cannot enter from behind, so I'll... this isn't good, 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 this isn't good. Please don't don't fight, don't fight, don't fight, please, 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 please. Oh, thank god. Oh, thank god. Uh am I really supposed to see? Oh, I was about to say, like what the hell is that all about? Oh, we found an inn. Yes. 
please don't let me have to go into a church to revive my friends. That would be really annoying. Oh, thank God. All right, so let's get some items. Let me see. Uh, what is this? This doesn't seem to be the item. This seems to be the armory, maybe? Or who knows, maybe it's the item shop. Let's check. Yep, it is. So Phoenix Downs costs a lot of moolah. So I'll get four, I guess. And then I'll get potions. Can I sell anything? Let me see something. What is the beast liver? Material that raises... Um, okay. Right, so those are equipped. Those are equipped as well. But what is that item though? Let me see something. Hang on. What the heck is that? Let me see. Items. I guess it's just a regular item. You don't equip it, I'm guessing. Beast liver. Okay. Can be used in compounding. You know what? I know I can use it for probably like uh, creating items or whatnot, but for now. Uh, it's not even worth that much, so selling it has no advantage. All right. Let's do some more random battles, and in fact, let's go over here. Hang on, let me see something. All right, I want to go to on the bottom screen, like upstairs. There's a quest that I can take. I want to see what that quest is all about. Probably nothing serious. Probably go to the cave and kill the beast. Right here. Oh, Lady Vestal, you've come at a perfect time. There's something I'd like to ask of you. Will you hear me out? I'm thinking of... Uh, sending some energy brew to the people of Norendi village, but I'm missing one of the ingredients beast lever If you come across any can you pass them on to me? I need five. I only have three though You can get beast livers by defeating panthers and white cats as you come across plenty of them that's roaming the desert Okay, so I, I got I got three man You are too kind Okay. How to change jobs like jobs in the menu changing jobs affects your base stats and determines your equipment aptitude so it goes attention when gearing up all right so command abilities uh la support is passive that work just by being equipped okay that's good to know i really love that final fantasy 9 how you get these these weapons that you equip and each of those weapons have levels and when you master each weapon you gain the abilities with that for that that weapon has like it has like skills I think I had passive abilities too as well. I haven't played that game since like 2001 or something like that. So it's been a while, but I really love that. All right, let me go back to the settings and put the difficulty. Let's put the encounter rate. Let's put it at 100%. You know, get things done quicker. Oh, you saw that? That was quick. Well, 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 look who it is. Damn, why are they going so quick again? That's kind of cheap, man. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? No, oh, we'll do. We'll attack this damn cat. Hopefully, I can jump in time and not get killed. And then they have to worry about drain. I think we'll see. Uh-huh, there we go. Yeah, so she did attack three times, because it said three hits. That's why it was about 20-something or 30-something HP. I just realized that. Graves will only do two attacks, you know. Just just to have the ability to go again on the next turn, you know. So what I'll do is I'll use a Phoenix now. Hopefully she doesn't die she doesn't die immediately after getting up. I'm guessing also you don't really gain much much uh must much HP when you get revived like the other games. Oh, yeah, that's how it's done. Oh, damn, she got a lot of HP when she got revived. I kind of feel sorry for you guys, <clears throat> motherfucker. All right, let me see something. I need a white mage, man. I really do. Fuck oh, fell. Something fell back there. Hang on. Sorry, guys. Something fell in my living room. Right, let's see if we can jump on this guy. I think this guy has the most health, so hopefully. What the hell is wrong? 
Maybe it's on the floor. Damn, man, I hate when they miss. Alright. Alright, I think this guy's about to die soon, so... I just thought that maybe when you had, you're a knight or a ninja, you would have abilities from the start, but you really gotta level up to get that stuff. Which is fair, because, I mean, it would kind of be kind of garbage if, like, in the demo, you know, they give you all the abilities, it would be kind of kind of whack, I'm not gonna lie. See, three hits, it, hit, it, was, it was 20. His was one, it was 13, so... I wish I had an auto... A auto ability, I mean, auto attack button like they do in Etrian Odyssey and uh, Shin Megami Tensei. That would be pretty cool. Alright, this guy's going downtown. Damn, 6 HP was the only thing he had left? Man. Alright, hang on guys, give me a moment. Let me, cause some, they was making some noise in my living room. Hang on, hope I'm not getting robbed. Sorry about that. Yeah, no, I wasn't getting robbed. All right, so I got a beast liver. I think I need one more. So we'll get into one more fight, but let's heal up just in case. I don't like how the menu has its own song, like its own theme. It's kind of, I don't know, it's kind of weird. It, it, it has like a Professor Layton feel to it. I don't know. Yeah, so I just need one more beast liver. Let's see if we can... Oh, I'm poisoned. Fuck. Forgot to heal that. Okay. We'll break that up. And... No, no, no. I'm sorry. Default it up. Default it up. Jump it up. And, uh... Default it up? Because you're kind of useless right now. But it, it's cool because it's like you're defending. Like, I felt like before the old Final Fantasy games, like, it was pointless to defend. Like, it really was. Like, there was no advantage because you can just cast Shell or Protect on yourself and call it a day. Or Wall. If you cast Wall, then you're good as well. You know? Like, it was kind of pointless, really. Alright. Let's do... We'll default it up again, just in case. Oh, that's how that felt good, right? Oh, you're gonna die. Oh, motherfucker. Ah, you, oh, you, oh, you dodged that one. Nice. Right, I'll give you that one. But you know what? You're going down. You know what? Actually, let's use it on. Let's let's get the ninja girl to do it. Oh, 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 you're gonna die, motherfucker. Oh, you're gonna die. Feels good, right? Oh, it felt real good, right? Oh, you're gonna die. I'm so sorry, Snakey. All right, everyone leveled up. Cool. I'm still quite far from getting my Black Mage level two, but and we did not get a uh, liver. I think I have antidotes. Let's see. Antidotes. Ah, oh, fuck, I only have one. Okay. I think, I think it's the, the cat, yeah, the cat gives it to you, and the cheetah. I, I, I thought that it was the, the snake that gave it to you. Well, 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 look who it is. Look who it is, huh? Sorry, Gato. But you're going downtown. Oh, damn. I'm surprised I survived that one. Not good. Okay.
I'm just gonna attack the cat. I don't care if the jump is a waste, goes to a waste. I'm just not gonna risk it. Alright, tis. Tis the season to be jolly. Oh, I felt good, right, cat? <laughs> Here you go, Tis the Season. Oh, thank you. Damn, I feel like he's weak. I think the ninja's way better than him. You know what? I'll take my chances here. And I'll make him jump on this guy. Yo, let's jump him! He ate that one. Oh shit, the guy from Warframe ate it. Doesn't he look like a character from Warframe? Damn, man, you still alive? Come on, fall. Oh, I'm so sorry, Snakey. Oh, I'm so sorry, Snakey. Do I got a liver? Let's see here. Oh, I got a beast liver. Cool, cool, cool. And I got an antidote. But I'm going to save it. Oh, I thought I was going to get into a random encounter. Let me put that thing right back down. Hang on. Let's see. Uh, it's going to go right down. Ouch. All right. Man, it's like the character model to the dude in the end is so shitty. Like, it's really bad. Like, Quest 64 status. I think that's a red mage. Alright, let's go up here. Ah, oh, Lady Vestal, you've gathered up everything I asked for. Thank you so much. Now I can whip up a batch of my special energy brew. All right, we got 400 PG, PG-13. Um, and now we got another quest that we have to complete. Let me see, I got some items, but I don't think I have much money. Uh, let me see, I got 518 PG. Okay, so that's, I guess they don't call it Gil anymore. Uh, okay, I didn't know this. It seems like you have to buy scrolls to use magic? What the hell? That's so weird. You know what? This is all I'll do. I'll buy Blizzard. I'll buy this. I'll buy these. And I'll buy Cure. Oh, I should have bought Arrow. Arrow is awesome. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, I was thinking of Arrow from Kingdom Hearts. But we'll keep it like this for now. So, wait a minute. Did she just learn the abilities? I don't have to give her the scroll. Let me see something. Ah, that's so weird. That's kind of... I don't know how I feel about that. That's not... I don't know. That's kind of... It's kind of weird. I don't like it. Hang on. Who has the... Oh, right here. This guy right here. Oh, Lady Vestal, you've got to listen to me. I'm really short on help right now. I don't suppose you can lend the hands. Lately, a strange illness has been going around the Norindi village area. You could almost call it a curse. I'm crafting some accessories that raise resistance to magic, but I need seven more demon tails to finish them off. As you might guess, demon tails can be culled from demonic creatures. The fastest way to obtain them around here would be to track down the imps that roam the desert at night. Okay, that's a lot of money. Yes, I'm definitely going to accept that quest. Register other players you'd like to play with as friends. What the hell? You can summon friends to aid you in battle. That's so weird. I gotta stop saying weird. Alright, whatever. Let's do this. So, is there like any way that I can manipulate time? Or do I have to just wait? Because, you know, in Extra Odyssey, you can manipulate time. And... 
Okay, it's daytime as you can see here. So what I'll do, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna go to tactics. I'm gonna bring the I'm gonna bring the encounter rate all the way down, right? And then I'm gonna walk around until it's nighttime. Unless certain areas automatically activate uh, night, which I doubt. What's in here? Let me see. You can't enter it. I'm guessing it's the demo. I guess just the world map is open, or maybe just the caves. Let me see. What's this? What's in here? Let me see. Huh? That's kind of cool. But I don't think you can fight the imps here. Oh, what the fuck? Yo, what the hell? You got traps up in here, man? Let's see what we got. Phoenix down. Cool. Don't have to buy any more. Well, I don't gotta buy one. Ooh, more treasure chests. Star pendant obtained. Who needs that star pendant? Okay. So, you remember how I said that it's a shame that it plays the mu- It has its own music, the menu? As you can hear, it does it now. It's awesome. I love that. I love hearing the music in the background. Oh, wow. This music is freaking awesome. All right, so where's the pendant? Star pendant, let's see what it does. Star shape pendant that nullifies poison. Okay. And I'm blind right now. I don't have anything, I don't have eye drops. Fuck. That means I'm gonna miss. Crap, that's not good. Oh, oh, oh you missed me. Now you gotta kiss me. Now what's this? It only gets worse from here on in. Oh yeah, let's save. Hey, look, it's the guy from uh, <laughs> Resident Evil 4. All right, let me go over here first, hang on. Maybe there's some items over here. Oh, oh, miss me, now you gotta kiss me. Miss me, miss me, miss me. Hang on, what's down there? Well, let me get the chest first. Fuck, I'm paralyzed. I'm wondering if the reason why I'm not getting into battles is because I've lowered the encounter rate. That's kind of cheap, don't you think? Alright, let's see. Oh, awesome. Can you get two weapons? Nah, you can't. You can't equip two. Oh, you can? Oh, this is awesome. Awesome, awesome. I'm gonna fuck this guy up, even if I miss. I don't care. Let's do this. How does it get worse here on end? I don't get it. The fuck's over here? You know what? No. This is kind of weird. Hang on. Let's bring the encounter rate. Just pull it high. You know what? Oh shit, yeah, I got into a battle. And those are not imps, and I'm blind to make matters worse. Wow, that's a lot of enemies. They're probably powerful too, but luckily I have magic. Um, let's see. Group casting allowed. Awesome. How do, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. How do you do group, group casting? Hang on. Oh, you do have an auto attack feature. I didn't want to fucking attack though. Fuck! Oh, this isn't good. How do I stop this? Oh, I'm getting raped. It's not good. Um, it's not safe to continue battling, so what I'll do is... Continue battling. 
Let me see something. How do you do um, group casting? Oh, all foes. I'm, I'm blind. Obstruct? What the hell is that? Oh, wow. Well, protect ally. Fuck. We're gonna have to run. Shit, man. We are running. Crap. Shit, man. Fuck. Wow, I got raped. Luckily, I saved. Holy crap, man. That was intense. This game does not play around. This game on normal is difficult. Wow. Oh, man. Okay, so I'm blind. Oh, this kind of sucks. You know what I'll do? I'll put in normal. Normal rates encounter. The only thing is I don't have... Um, I don't think this guy heals. Yeah, nah. It's not good. Yeah, man, I'm blind. Let me see, what abilities I have? Nope, nothing. Always damage, nope. And I forgot to equip my two swords. Which is fine. Okay, so he blocked fire, so maybe thunder will break through it. We'll see. Damn, man, I'm gonna have to run because it's like. Okay, no, he he. Ring a bell can take him. Yeah, thunder pierced through. So for now, I'll just have him jump and just use thunder. Okay, I'll just have I'll have Tiz and Agnes just default because they're just doing nothing right now. Okay. So he's the only useful one right now. I got uh, one eye drop. Thanks. Thanks for helping me a lot. That's gonna be very useful. But at least I can take Agnes out of that um blind though, so I remember, if I recall correctly, I don't think, um, I don't think that blind affects your, um, I don't think that it affects your ability to hit your accuracy for magic. I think it's just physical attacks. I think. Oh, great. So here we go. I'll just do this for now. And I'll have Ring a Bell obviously jump, and I'll have Thunder, and I'll cast it on everyone. Hopefully it hits. We'll see. Brave Robber, what the hell? Shit. Holy fuck, man. He's gonna not hit though, that's the only thing. So I'll just give Agnes that. I'll have her brave it out. Hopefully, it could kill one of these guys. Specifically, him. Alright, let's see if I can survive this turn.
Alright, come on, fall! Damn, these guys have a lot of HP. Oh, come on, give her the potion already. I'm gonna die, man. This isn't good. Alright, um... What I'll do is... This guy right here, huh? Alright, so... Uh, combatants. Alright. And... I don't think I have any more potions. Nope. I think I have white magic, though. Yep. I'm guessing when you divide it up, I guess divide it up by four. I don't think it does the same amount as, um, it doesn't restore as much HP as when you focus on one guy, but for now, I'll just do it on her. Alright, two more to go. Come on, jump already. What's taking him so long to jump? He's gonna miss though, it's the only thing that sucks. Okay, that's cool. Ah, oh, ring a bell, come on. Hopefully he can jump before this guy attacks him. If not, I'll just... I think... I don't think you could cure him once he's in the air, though. Let me see. Okay, he's down. I'm in ground still. I'll be good. Let me... I'll just do all foes just to see how it is. All allies. Whoa, that was an intense battle, man. Finally, three eye drops. Thank God. Ah, shit. Shit, man, unbelievable. Now they're all blind again. Unbelievable. These are the only ones that need it, so. And I think I'm running out of. Oh, I got a good amount of HP. How do you cure them all? No, I don't think you can. Alright, it's so whatever. I'm gonna get my new sword and call it a day. Alright, let's see if I can get out of here. Fuck, man! Damn, this kid is ruthless. Let's get out of here. Damn, I should have saved. Again? Not good. I'm gonna have to run. You know what I'll do? I'll just jump, just in case. Oh, thank god. Thank goodness. I escaped. Fuck, 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 fuck. Come on, let's get out of here. We got what we need. I'm guessing a quest is what... That room where you said, oh, it's gonna be dangerous. I'm guessing that's maybe for, like, uh... Later on, probably, so... And obviously, you know what I'm gonna do here. I'm gonna bring my encounter rate down. And I'm gonna run back to town and sleep because being blind sucks in Final Fantasy games. It's not as bad as Etronodicy, but or I, th I don't think Shin Megami Tensei. I don't think it has a blind. I don't. I don't recall Part Four having a, a, a blind uh, abnormal status. But all right, let's just see if I can. I gotta buy some eye drops, man. That place was ruthless, man. Alright. Time to buy some items. And hopefully we can run into those imps. Eye drops, finally. Damn, I only have... You know what? I'll buy... I'll buy eight. Ah, what the hell. Ten it is. Just might as well spend all my money, right? 
And I have a t they have fast traveling with the teleport stone. I don't remember what the old Final Fantasy did for fast travel. Like I, I don't, I don't think it did. I don't remember. I think all these Western RPGs have uh, killed my memory here. So let's just walk around and hopefully, um, hopefully I can just you know like get tonight. Let's see what's in here. Is this the town that they're talking about? Let me see. Oh no, another cave. I'm definitely not going in there. You know what's so cool about this demo? It feels like an open world game, don't you think? Like, I love that about games. I haven't played um, Zelda uh, Link Between Worlds yet because I'm trying to beat uh, Shin Megami Tensei 4 before I really complete that because I beat Echo Odyssey 4. Uh, what else did I beat on the like there were some other games that I didn't really I didn't really get into much on the on the 3ds Like I, I couldn't get into project cross zone. Like I felt like it was just so repetitive. I couldn't do it But I, I played a lot of Etron Odyssey 4 like I probably clocked in over 120 hours in that game It's insane. Okay. I think it's nighttime now. Is it nighttime? I, no, it seems like dusk, but I'll bring the encounter rate up though just in case Oh, there we go. It's nighttime. Let's where are these imps at? Damn, no imps, really? Alright, so we're just gonna default this. We're gonna jump on the white cat. And then for this, what's the black cat's weakness? You know what? Hang on. Where is it? Who has that ability? Hang on. Is it her? Who had the ability to see... Uh, you know what I think? I think I think it was another class. I wanted to see what the, the status... The status of the white cat was. Is it him? No, it's not. Alright, let's try this out. Shit, man, you saw that? Holy crap! Damn, that was a lot of HP she took. He's gonna die. All right, let me see something. Fuck! Damn, man, she didn't get any level up. That's, you see, that this is the perfect example right here. Everyone's level 4 except Edia. Which sucks. But it's whatever. I'll just bring her back here and then the next battle she'll level up. Damn, that sucks, man. She got raped. Where are the imps? Man? Alright, let's test this out. Please, imps, come out. And looky, looky, we're fighting some imps, but I don't think I'm gonna get what is she? I think she needed like seven or something like that. So, wow, what a way to stretch out this demo, right? <laughs> we'll just default, default, um, the usual jump. I don't think, like, I wanna know, like, when you're, when you're doing the brave, can you, you know what? I'm gonna test that out. Let me see something. Let's go. I want to know, like, ring a bell, for instance. He has the the jump ability. What hap- Ah, oh, man, it did silence on Edia. Damn, sucks. Wait a minute. Is that also going to prevent jump? No way. That's impossible. 
That's crazy. He's not gonna let him jump, really? That's impossible. It's not a it's not a magic attack. Oh, I'm an idiot. I did I did the default. Alright, hang on, let me see something. So can I do jump? Yeah, you see like it I think I think default is only for like I think when you default and then you use Brave, I don't think you can use abilities. I think it's just for attacks. That's what it seems like so far. But then with her, she can... I think when she does a Brave, she can use magic. Yeah, see? It lets her use magic. Which is weird. Like, so why can't he do two jumps? It could just very well be because when he jumps, it takes a turn. So I think it's only when you have abilities that are done within that turn rather than the next turn, like the jump attack. So that's what it probably is. And, okay, there we go. And these guys are just casting silence over and over again. So I might not be able to do my magic on my next turn. Shit, man. I sacrificed two of my turns for him. Alright. So I want to know, why is it that now I can't do a default? Like, is there a limit to the amount of defaults that I can do? Could be. I don't know. Hopefully they don't do silence on me. Hey, what does fear do? Does it just bring down your defense or something? I want to remember fear. Yeah, obviously, I mean, when you divide it, as you can see there, it wasn't as, as strong, so... Kind of sucks, but... Yeah, so I don't know what the status uh, fear does. Like, it, and it's not countdown. Remember countdown? What was it, um, death? When it has a countdown? But I don't think it's that either, so... I don't know. So look, like when I do Braves, right, he can keep going, but you know what I'll do? You just have to plan it out better, that's all. You know what, hang on. Yeah, so I think you can't default. I don't think, I think when you go over the amount of uh, Braves with the Brave points, I don't think, I think maybe there's a cooldown period for when you can do it again, I don't know. I'll put it to the test right now. I'll attack, attack, and then I'll just use Brave. Right there. See, he can go, go again, and then he jumps. Can he? Is he gonna jump? Let me see. Why didn't he jump? Is it because it also... Let's gonna do it later, let me see. I'll tell you right now. Fucking silence, man. Oh, see? He did jump. Okay, that's cool. Oh, she is so lucky. Alright, let me see. Leveled up. I think... Damn, man, she would have been a level 2 uh, black mage, too, but... Alright, so Tiz gained a job level. You've learned two-handed support ability. I thought he already had two-handed support ability. Unless it's um two-handed meaning for one weapon, rather than having two different weapons. Learn, transcend, support. You learned Crescent Moon. This game is amazing. This is like... I don't see a game being better than this in 2014. Period. I just don't see it. So this is what I'm gonna do. I did not get... Oh, I got three Demon Tails. So I need to get... What is it? Um. Can you see the quest though? Like, let me see something. Hold on. Nah. I don't think it gives you the... I, I don't think there's any way that you can check your quest that's unless it's here let me see something is it this right here 
Ah, uh, street pass. No, it's not. Um, no. So, um, that kind of sucks. But uh, let me see. I forgot to equip him with two weapons. Hang on, let me see something. Yeah. All right. Wait, I got a white cape too. What's this all about? A thin, beautiful cape that nullifies silence. Okay. Now we're just gonna switch. This with the white cape, and what does this do again? I think it's nullifies poison. I'll just give it to Ringo Bell. All right. So I need to heal up. She's has silence. Fuck. Is there? Okay. And I ran out of potions already. Fuck. Damn it! It's not good. Um, I'm just gonna have to get back to town and sleep, but then I'm obviously gonna wake up in the day, so that kind of blows. But, it's whatever. Let's get out of here. I'm really enjoying this game. I think, I mean, it could just be because obviously the demo's open. It could be that as well. I'm, I'm guessing that the, the main game is gonna be linear as well. But man, like, I really like it. Like, the music is great. The characters... Even though I'm not getting any story right now, I really like their design. I really like the character design. I love their names, too. I love the the battle system. I think the battle system is probably... Damn, it's it's up there Like when it, with turn-based RPGs. I don't think you can make it into an active battle system because then it will kind of break the whole default and brave system. I just wonder, like, how, how different is the battle system compared to the other the other version of this game? And what is Bravely Second going to do that's going to make this game even better, you know? Damn, I keep going to the menu to save. Alright. So let's, let's... Ah, oh, damn it. Let me just walk around till night. Like, I really like the old school feel of this game. Like, there's not much RPGs that are released like this anymore. And I, it's like... I feel like every time like an indie dev promises something like there's this there's this game it's called Penny Arcade um, something slick slick back or something like that it's like an indie RPG and episode one and episode two were 3D three dimensional games and then part three came out and it was supposed to be an old school RPG and I played it and I despised that game. Like, I feel like when these developers promise, oh, you know, I'm gonna make the game old school, it, it really isn't old school, you know, like, I, that's just how I feel, like, I feel like they're trying too hard to make it like that, and it just doesn't work, in my opinion. And then I think, um, the same developer that did that game did a game called, um, something Cthulhu, it's like an RPG, no, it's not Cthulhu, is it? It's a game that is like, you're a, you're a skeleton, something undead. Imps, finally, there we go. And I don't know, like, I felt like it was kind of cool and all, but I don't know, it just didn't have the feeling that this game has, you know, and other portable RPGs have either. I find myself gravitating more towards, like, Western RPGs now, just for the customization. And I think games like Shin Megami Tensei 4, I never played the previous ones, but Shin Megami Tensei 4 has a Western feel to it because it's fully customizable, like, your look. When your character equips items, you can see it. Uh, you can get new party members that are monsters, and then the whole world, Tokyo, is open. Like, I really like that about that game. And Etrian Odyssey 4, to me, is very Western as well because of how customizable your classes are. Final Fantasy 7 and 8 didn't really have that. 9, eh, not really there. I think 10 was very customizable with the abilities. But then everyone just ends up being the same when you finish the grid, the sphere grid, you know? Alright, so... Let's see here. I gotta be careful with these douchebags. So what I'll do... Is I'm just gonna default it out. And default it out all day and move on to the next turn. Oh, so I think I got a preemptive strike on them because they didn't go. Cool. Alright, let me see the ability I got. What did I get? I could have sworn he learned something. Ah, oh, I think I gotta equip it. Wait. Let me see. No, ninjutsu. Yeah, no, I think you have to equip the... That kind of sucks. 
kind of weird. Alright, so I'll attack. You know what I'll do? I'll attack this guy, and then I'll jump him. Oh, wait a minute. Crescent? A physical attack... Oh, you know what? I think that Tiz and Agnes probably learn passive abilities. A physical attack on all enemies. Let's try that. And then I'll brave it up. I'll do... Let's do Blizzard. Let's test it out. And then we'll do Fire, just to see which one is stronger. Oh, damn. He ate that one. Once again, doing fear, huh? Oh, damn, that was freaking awesome! Oh, you're dead, bro. It's over. Give me a favor and give me those, uh... Those demon fangs, or whatever they're called. Awesome, let's see what she learned. You learned black magic level two. What's the difference? Demon tail, I just need one more and it's over. Let me see, hang on. All right, God, it's um. <laughs> it's like this Professor Layton music is so funny. Nothing ventured. Use Swordmaster command abilities. What is this? Hold sword axe in both hands to raise. Eh. Shimmery protect ally. Yeah, no, it seems like, um. Oh, I see, I see. Counter after evading attack. Oh, that's freaking awesome. Oh, man, this game is so freaking sweet. I love it. Okay. But it says that she can equip multiple weapons in one hand, too. I just don't have any. So that's why she's not attacking more than I thought she would. Okay. We gotta buy some weapons, but I don't have enough money. So we just get this, and then we're done. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, oh, fuck. I forgot to equip level 2 magic, I think. Alright, imps. It's over. Why is it that? Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay, okay. I was wondering why he had two. It's because I remember I equipped it as well. Let me see something. Great. Oh, thank God it missed. Oh, I wonder if I can use. Um, it would be awesome if I could use Crescent Moon multiple times. That would be so crazy. How do you do level two? Like, is when it says love black magic level two, does it mean that you're just attacking stronger? Like, that's what I want to know. It's over, dude. You're dead. Demon Tail, okay, so we finished the quest. And I think that's I think that's it. Let me see. I think this is so awesome. Like, oh man, I've never played a game that did that before that you can adjust the encounter rate. Like, who freaking thought of that? You're a genius. Alright, let me see something. Wow. I wanted to see him. Let me see. I think if I stay still, it zooms out. Let me see. Yeah, it does. Let me see the 3D hand. Eh, nothing impressive, but that shot alone is, is impressive. The art direction in this game is amazing. Let's go in here real quick. Let's just sleep.
I got a call from someone earlier, and I just don't recognize the number, so I googled the number, and it said it was like a locksmith. I'm talking to you guys, by the way. All right, so we're done with this quest. Wow, you got every last one. This is great. This should be plenty for now. You're a lifesaver. Abilink lets you use abilities that your friends have learned. Have a friend who's farther along, borrow one of their powerful abilities, or coordinate them. Eh, I don't want to use that. It's kind of broken. Eh, I mean, I guess it'll be fun later, but I wouldn't use that whatsoever. I like leveling up my characters alone, period. Unless it's a co-op game, but... Alright, let's test, let's see, what mission is this? Oh, Lord Vestal, just the person I wanted to see. There's something I'd like to ask of you. Might I trouble you for a moment? An intruder has been spotted in the cave to the west, which we've been using as a storehouse. I left it in the hands of some other whippersnappers, but they're made shambles of it. Can you go and drive out the intruder? I definitely remember this. This is the cave that I went to earlier, remember? And I think after this, I'll just end the video, guys, because it's, um, this video is kind of long. And I don't know if YouTube is, uh, well, YouTube is a problem when it comes to uploading HD videos that are super long. Because for some reason, uh, it has a lot of problems once it reaches, like, maybe, what is it like? I think once it passes three or four gigs, it's an issue. Alright, so let's see. Who can equip? I need something that the... Ninja can use. Hang on. You know what? I'm gonna buy this. And then I'm gonna buy this. Alright, then... The mace. Oh, that would be good, but it's not really that much powerful though, so... I'm not gonna waste my money. I'll also buy... I'll buy three of these. And damn, I shouldn't have bought three of those. Fuck, we're wasting money. Hang on. Hang on. The feather hat is better for her. I'll buy this. I'll buy two of these. And what is this? Armor? Okay. I don't have enough. Alright, so let's do some equipping. I mean, I could use the optimize, but... And then... Why does she have that, though? Why does it say S on it? What does S mean? I don't know what that's all about. I thought I bought a rod. Let me see something. Let me see something. I'll give her... Alright, so she can equip twice. And then, I think I only have one helmet. Actually, I, I don't. Oh, okay, I see, I see. It just won't. It's just some games for some reason. Like, I don't know why it does this, but it's like, it still allows you to take away from the other person's uh, inventory, which is weird. I, think, I don't think Dragon Quest does that. I think I'll tell you. Alright, so I gave him a shield. I think I need to really buy her a shield. Yeah, there we go. All right, so I think I'm done here. Let me do something, hang on. I think I could sell something maybe, hang on. Why did I buy two of these unless... I don't get it, why do I have two? Hang on. That would be awesome if I have two. Okay, eh, it's fine. It's a better weapon anyway, so... The only thing that worries me is that she doesn't have a helmet, so... I don't know if I have enough for one. Let me see. Have eye drops, that's good. The cave. I 
Yeah, no, I don't have enough, I think, for a helmet. Yeah, sucks. Um... You know what, I'll just give her the feather hat. If you guys haven't noticed already, the only thing that you're really gonna see change uh, their physical appearance is their their job class system. Like once you start getting into the equipping weapons and stuff, I think maybe the weapons I haven't noticed, but I think the weapons change. But like helmets, hats, and stuff like that, they don't change your appearance. Which it sucks. Like if you guys ever played Final Fantasy Ring of Fate for the for the for the DS which is very underrated. I really love that game. I didn't like the second one. I felt like if it, it, it focused too much on the co-op and then the story was shit, but the story for Ring of Fate was great. Like you guys should really try to track that game down for the DS and play it because it was a great story. The caves, like the dungeons were a little repetitive, but I think that the, the combat was pretty cool. And the story, like I said, very heartwarming story. Let's get this started. You know what I'll do? I'm gonna keep the encounter rate the way it is because I just wanna get rid of these douchebags and call it a day. I just gotta be careful because I think if I were to cross while it's it's steaming up like that, I think I'll get hit with blind and I don't wanna get hit with blind. Yep, see? The enemy's in there now. So, it seems like, uh, I'm, I'm guessing maybe the main game is like that, like certain areas will have new things depending on the quest that you accept which is fine it's whatever let's get this started oh damn no talking just battling well she looks cool all right let's default 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 and we'll default <laughs> a robot shit Alright, bro, you're going down, Missy. Sorry, Toots. Yep, you can use it twice. That's so broken. That's funny. So I'm gonna heal and then I'm gonna attack. Hang on. Ring a bell, I got your back, don't worry. And then I'll freeze this bitch. Oh, she defaulted too? Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Shit. Alright, he did decent damage. Damn, that's not good. What a waste. Damn, I did shit damage there. Ah, oh, that's not good. Let's try again. Ah, that's not good. Oh, shit. Damn, I'm doing shit damage. Alright, let's try again. I think I got Phoenix down. Yes, I do. I think it, it's like... I guess when I use Crescent Moon, it's more of a demanding move, so it takes maybe more Brave Points, probably. But man, I didn't expect it to... to be like that, though. Hang on, I'll just... I'll heal Agnes, because she needs to heal. What the fuck, man? Really? That is not good, man. Damn, really? What the hell? You know what I'll do? I'll just try to evade one physical attack. And then, I don't know if she's gonna heal right away. I hope not, but let's see. I did a decent job healing everyone.
I'll just heal again. Oh man, this girl. When is she gonna fall? She's doing a lot of defaults just to... Oh, she countered! Oh, damn. Alright, so I think, I think it's over. She's gonna die right now. I'll just default this character. Agnes will default, and then I'll just do Crescent. See, look at that. It seems like, you see right here, look. There's abilities that seems to take two turns before you get to do you get to move again jump obviously you're gonna notice that jump you're not gonna really feel it because jump is not done on the same turn so it takes one turn to charge and then the other turn it comes back down but crescent moves since it's done on the same turn you do it and yeah that's pretty much it so you're gonna have to wait another turn so you're kind of sacrificing so i'm just gonna jump just to you know protect them as well all right let's do thunder What the hell is that? Please don't do, uh... Fuck. Shit, man! Fuck! It did charm on me. It's not good. You know what I'll do? Fuck this shit. Let's do this. You're gonna die, bitch. Especially when, when freaking ring a bell comes down. It wasn't for that cure, man. Who got who got charmed? Agnes got charmed? Oh no, nah. chill, 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 chill. Can't have that, man. Damn, man. Oh. I didn't get charmed, so that's not bad. Let's see if I could bring Tiz back up here. Alright, Tiz, uh, that's cool, like when you die. Aw, oh, man, that's not good. Alright, no one got charmed except Tiz. Alright, it's not bad. Alright, so. I'm, gonna, I'm taking my chances here, so fire, 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 fire. I'm doing about 100 damage with just her alone. So once ring about comes down, that's about 100 possibly. And then Eddie is gonna do her magic, so. I'm risking it though. She might not die. Hopefully Tiz snaps out of his charm though, so... Yeah, he did. Damn, man. Crap. This is a long ass boss battle. It's over. He's gonna die. Once we're, once. She's not gonna default, I think, so. Oh man. Shit, he's got, no wait, that's Agnes. It's not too bad. Man, that was an intense battle. Imagine a heart. Whoa, 30 points? Oh, boss battles are rewarding in this game, it seems. You got a play bonus. Okay, cool. That sucks. It's like the play bonuses is like... They basically just give you, um... Items. That's the advantage you get. Eh. 
I mean, I'm playing this demo not for the play bonus, honestly. It's just because it's fun. And the game is about, as of this recording, about a month and change away. So it's not too bad, you know? The wait's not going to be too bad. Especially since um, January alone is a couple of games that I'm going to be getting. You have set your support ability, blah, 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 blah. Then you don't get any benefits unless they are equipped from blah, 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 blah. I don't care. Okay. So let's go and report our, our mission here. And that we have destroyed that... It's just like a succubus, right? Like a Morrigan or a Lilith-like character. Speaking of Lilith, man, I can't wait to get the Blu-ray release of Evangelion 3.33. Woohoo! It's gonna be crazy! I can't wait to watch it in English. I watched it in Japanese a couple of months ago in the summer, and it was like, I don't care what anyone says, character development aside, man, that that movie fucking blew my mind, man. That animation quality and the action, woo, man, it was crazy. Very, very uh, particular with my animes. I, anime has poor animation, can't get into it. I don't know what it is. All right, let's report this. You did an excellent job clearing out the trespasser, most helpful. I'll have to work on training up the whippersnappers we have around here. All right, let me see this mission. Well, if it isn't Lady Vesta, I don't suppose you'd be able to take a little task, would you? This is what we need. You heard of Monster Fiber before, blah, 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 blah. Ten Monster Fibers. I'll accept the quest. Oh, thank you. Well, guys, I'm gonna end it here. I think from now, from here on, it's just mainly just fetch quests. There was a cave that I was gonna, um, that I was gonna crawl, but I'll leave it here. The video is long enough. I apologize for that, guys, but I really hope that anyone who's sat through this entire video enjoyed the game enough to go out and buy it because Square Enix needs to know that RPGs like this, people still crave them, all right? And although I'm sure they're not gonna strive as much as they did during the PS1 or possibly PS2 era, I still feel that handhelds is the only, the, the only platform left where we get true gems, okay? So if we don't support this game, I don't know, man. I mean, I'm sure there's other developers out there that we can get great RPGs from. But I think this is like the first classic RPG on the 3DS that I can think of without that first-person dungeon crawling, which there's nothing wrong with that. I love it. Uh, without first-person view battle systems, which there's nothing wrong with that. I love it. Without collecting monsters like... <laughs> SMT4 and Pokemon, which there's nothing wrong with. I love that too. And the most, the thing that kills me the most is story sequences that are told with fucking pictures. That pisses me off, man. And you know what? When I was taking the shit earlier, I was Googling about this game. And I saw that this game commits that crime, but I don't think it's as bad. I don't know, I know. I gotta I got play the full game. But I'm gonna end it here, guys, and I hope you enjoyed the game. Please support this game. Oh, man, I'm getting this game day one collector's edition, period. Later, guys.